Hey there, Amy Star Allen here. And in this video today, I'm gonna to go over a couple of the features of the Facebook professional dashboard, as well as the Instagram professional dashboard, and show you some ways that you can use these dashboards to help you grow your business. So I'll start off by showing you this on my desktop, and then I will also show you how to access this from your phone. So if you come to your Facebook account, you will see right here, at the very top right where it says professional dashboard. So if you just click on that, it's gonna give you a bunch of different stats here. If you click on insights, it'll give you some other additional insights. It'll show, show you how many views you've gotten. This is in the last 28 days. If you wanna change this time frame, you can change the time frame, And then it'll show you where your views are coming from, like 60.7% of mine are coming from photos and then videos, reels, links, multimedia, and text. And it'll show you your top content. If you wanna see all of your top content, you can click on see all and it'll give it all to you and it'll break it down by views, reach, interactions, earnings, and so forth. So this is a great place to come and see what's getting the most engagement because that's the type of content that you wanna create more of. And if you wanna use filters and just filter this out by videos or reels or anything like that, you can do that here. There's also tabs for monetization. If you click on engagement, it'll take you into your engagement tab, which has comments and mentions. So if you have comments that you haven't replied to yet, Facebook will show those to you all in one place right here. This is a great place to come in and just start replying to your comments. One of the other things that Facebook does that's really cool is it will tell you what to do to get more reach on your account. So if you come over here where it says weekly progress, this is in the home tab on the professional dashboard and click see all, it will give you a list of tasks to do for the week to help you optimize your page. So complete this week's task to gain new skills and grow as a creator. So Facebook is basically telling you what it wants you to do to get the most engagement, to get the most monetization, all of those things. And so anything that's completed, like I've already completed these two tasks down here, reply to five comments, I've done five out of five, get 20 more views on your content, I've done that already. But up here it'll say like create seven new public reels. I have zero of seven done. So it wants me to create seven reels, seven stories, I've got one out of seven complete of that, get five new followers, I've gotten one out of five of those and create five new public posts. I've got one out of five. So this is where you can track your weekly progress and make sure that you're keeping up with what Facebook wants you to do with your content creation. If you wanna do the same thing on your phone, you would just come to your account. When you're in your account and you just click on your profile icon at the bottom, you'll see where it says professional dashboard. Click on that. And it's basically the same thing that I just showed you, but on your phone. And then if you click on see all under next steps and go to continue your weekly progress, it will show you your weekly progress right here, just like I just showed you on desktop. And then for Instagram, it's basically the same thing. They don't give you your weekly checklist inside of Instagram, but if you come under your dashboard tab in your Instagram profile, it will give you all of your stats for all of your videos and so forth as well. It'll even show you like the times where your followers are available. You know, so this tells you what are the best times to post and so forth. Another cool feature inside of Instagram is if you click on any one piece of content and click on view insights, it will give you all of your insights for that particular piece of content. It'll tell you how many views you got and how many are based on followers versus non-followers, how many interactions you got from followers and non-followers. And then it'll also give you the stats for Facebook since Instagram and Facebook are connected. I always automatically share all of my reels from Instagram to Facebook. So it gives me the stats for Facebook as well right here. And if you don't have access to the professional dashboard, it's because you haven't turned on professional mode on your account. So if you want to turn on professional mode, you would just come to these three dots on your profile. And here where mine says turn off professional mode, if you don't have it yet, it'll say turn on professional mode. So you would just click on that and go through the prompts. 
and then you will have access to the professional dashboard. And on mobile, it's the same thing. Click, click these three dots and then click turn on professional mode at the bottom right there. So I hope, that, hope this helps for you to be able to start to track which pieces of your content are getting the most engagement. I mean, that's the most important thing. A lot of times we, we think that the amount of views that we're getting matters more than anything else. What's more important than views is engagement, is does my audience like this content? Are they engaging with this content? Is it helping them? So using the professional dashboard on Facebook and Instagram will help you to be able to better gauge whether your content is serving your audience. And it'll give you that weekly to-do list as well, if that will be helpful for you to stay on point with your content. So I hope this has been helpful. Give it a thumbs up if it has been. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And if you wanna learn about the other tools and resources that I use to build my business, and I've had a successful business online for over 20 years, I will leave that information below. And I have a whole bunch of other resources as well in the description of this video. So be sure and grab however many of those that you would like, and I will see you in the next video. Bye for now.